Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the Hyper Antics server. How's everyone doing? I hope you're doing well today. What we're going to focus on, we got some tooling going, right? Did this pickaxe last time. It's time to change up our mud hut situation. We need an actual spawn house. You see them popping up all around. Got a nice little bunker over here. We got Pudsy's area over there. Got the community building. Got Run Wild's food emporium up there. We, we can't keep mud huts around for much longer, so let's take care of this today, shall we? All right, the first order of business that we are going to do is just get rid of all of this right here. We're going to dig this back. And then I've collected all the materials that we're going to be using. Well, hopefully I've got enough. We shall see. Materials are kind of hard to come by at this stage in the game. But you know what? It is time to focus on the house. So let's take care of that, shall we? And we don't need that door right there. Let's get rid of that. Okay. Thank you. We are having some tick lag. I don't know if that's me or if it's the server. Let's see. 55 frames a second, 54. Yeah, better FPS might be good. Let's check the sun. Yeah, we got some tick lag going on. Okay, so let's not dwell on that so much. What I do need to do is grab some sand. Let's see if we can get down to here. And we're going to, no, I didn't put it there. We are going to, at this point, um, we got to get some sand cooking because we need some glass. So we may, well, you know what? We may not need glass. We're going to need some other stuff. So let's start out with getting our materials together. I'm sorry, I'm a bit confused. We're going to use glass panes, so the glass is going to actually stretch a little bit further than I'd originally figured. So we can throw all this stuff in here for now. At the moment, episode two has not gone out. So I don't know if I owe any Irish luck blocks or not. We're kind of recording this back to back. What we do need for this particular project though, is we need some stained clay, hardened stained clay, and then some mystical blue flowers. I didn't want to use my lapis because I want to load up the lapis on this pick. So we're gonna try and grab some dye out of the mystical blue flower and then the azure bluette. And we're going to use the pestle and mortar. And I think this should give us some blue dye. Oh, we, we use the petals and then this. Okay. Okay, that's good. Excellent, excellent, excellent. So for hardened clay, what do we need? Do I have any more hardened clay up here? I should have some. No, we got some seared brick. That's from last episode. No more hardened clay. We'll see if this is enough. It may may not be what do we need we need we need 56 because you got to use eight so i need so, somewhere around 50. Let's see do we have any more clay over here yeah um yeah we're gonna do that and we'll waste a little bit of of the coal but there's plenty of coal down in the mines below all right so we're going to be staining that in cyan. So let's just do what's 56 times times 8 50, or 56 divided by 8 is 7. So we need 7 of those. That's good. And then over here for the glass, we're going to use light gray. And we'll just make us some stained, stained glass. And I'm sorry for the problem there. I've got a new mouse coming. It's an issue I've been having and uh, it shouldn't continue much further. So we've got what, 16 there. Yeah, I'm having having major issues with my mouse. Light gray stained clay or stained glass and we'll need probably one more batch of that. So what we're going to do is unlike what everybody else has seemed to be putting together, in the area. They've gone for more of a medieval theme, kind of the standard starter theme. It's been a while since I've done a modern build, so 
we're going to do a modern build. I'm pretty excited about it. It's one that comes from a fellow hyperminer by the name of Hector Vink. He put together a couple of starter home ideas for modern homes, and we're going to be using one of those designs today. And it starts out with some cyan hardened clay and alabaster, and then oh, it shift clicks into the crafting window. That is pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I'm not sure what mod does that, but I like it. I like it a lot. And marble we'll need and basalt. What does this do? What does that give us? Basalt bricks. What if we did... What's that give us? Basalt paver. Um, That's actually more along the lines of what I want. We'll only need maybe this much. And then how about the marble? What's that do? I guess we have to have a, sh a chisel for that. So, hmm, what's a what's a chisel cost? Or what do we got to do there? Chisel, is it standard? Well, I don't want a diamond one. We don't have iron. We have some iron up here. Iron. Yeah, I could go over and and get some iron, but for now, I think, well, let's see, any other chisels? No, 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 no. I don't want to use a diamond on a chisel right now. That would be a waste, it, at least in my estimation. Yeah, that wouldn't be any good. So I know you're probably going to be sitting here saying, soap, uh, you could be doubling that. Hmm. We'll, we'll get to that later. Um, what, what we need to do right now, though, is get on with actually building this thing and stop faffing about here. Okay, let's close this, close this. And what we're going to do is grab the cyan hardened clay. And where do we want the door to be? Maybe facing that direction. So what we'll do is make, uh, we need a five five wide area so one two three four five like so and then one and we'll skip one and we've got do we have any more dirt can use more dirt um cobblestone for now okay there we go good enough and we'll come over like this we're gonna go one two three four five six seven okay and then we'll just come on back like so Okay, so you see all these stone torches around? Those stone torches are, are kind of special. The reason they're kind of special is that stone torches cannot be picked up by mobs in this mod pack. And yes, that is a thing in this mod pack. Um, I'm not sure what, what mod adds that, but, um, but yeah, so standard torches like the wooden ones, mobs will come in and they will pick them up and drop them on the floor or on the ground and that leaves you a little bit unprotected because then um, you know about the darkness mod yeah so mobs can cause additional problems for you I think it's cool I like I like the the extra challenge but it certainly is going to be interesting playing with that as we go forward um, what we're going to do is go right here and right here, and we will move the chest a little later. But uh, for now, what we need to do is come up with some alabaster, and we're going to go up and just cover this in like so, and we'll make sure to put, um, we'll just use that for now, and we'll go alabaster out like this, and then like this so in standard modern um, you might be used to seeing you've got a big white box and this one's no different so we are doing a white box but we don't have to use quartz I have not been to the nether but there are blocks in the overworld that suffice for this bright white color there we go and what else do we need 
We don't need that. We don't have any arrows. So we can come out by one on each side like this. And we'll get the standard white box without quartz. We use alabaster, which comes from environmental tech. I'm sure it has other uses for alabaster, but we're going to use it in a decorative, decorative build here. And then we'll go out one more over this way. And then we'll start adding in. In fact, we'll, we'll just do the structure primarily right now. Can we do? Yes, OK. Pick block is a thing here. We'll go up by one, two, three. Um, one, two, three, four. I have a height of three or height of two. Height of two, I think. Yeah, so we'll do this. And then we'll come over one more like that. And then we'll do the same right here. And this, this may be wrong. I may have to go back through and change the change the look a bit. No, that's too, that's too short. Yeah, that's, that's much too short. So let's come up here and do one more and we'll just get rid of the extras. Uh, like, like this. And the neat thing about using this pick is that I do get XP from it. And we'll connect that. I don't think there is a column or there should be a column, but let's get the general structure in place. And then we'll come back through with uh, with the additional details. OK, so there's our box, right? Standard white box. And then what we're going to do is come in with some spruce. And we've got to drop back down here. And we've got a bit of a lighting issue now. Come back down here, grab the spruce wood. And we'll just do this as well. Got other guests hanging out around. Uh, can we get up there? Nope, we can't get up there. We'll need to knock this out. And before the end of today's episode, we will come in and move all of that stuff. So um, the next order of business, we come out like that. And we're going to add a couple of wood uh, wood structures all the way around like that and perhaps I should have put or should have gone up with it and we will put a torch there just for the time being I am a little bit torch happy at the moment and you know if the darkness is going to hurt you I should hope that you would be similarly scared of the dark so I think that's a really again it's gonna add some challenge but I think we will be perfectly fine in the long run. There's an enchant that I can get on armor that gets rid of that damage, but um, is it, didn't that place wrong? It's hard to see. Okay, so that just dropped. And do we have any more? No more, ran out. Okay, so we can go across. We're gonna go across the top of our roof like this. We'll come back in later and try and make this a little more uh, spawn proof without torches, but you gotta gotta work with what you got. And we'll come around again like this right there. Nope. I've got an axe, but it is about to die. Okay, and we can go up and up. Up, nope, up, up, and we're out. So we'll just do a little bit more, and we should have the structure done. And there, okay. And now what I need to do is get some more of this material. So let's just take a step back, and I'm gonna go compare notes with what we should be doing. There's a couple of these pillars that we need to go we need to add in a balcony so uh, yeah let me go check let me go check on that and we'll get some more more of these uh, slabs going as well so I'll be back in just a moment all right we are back ladies and gentlemen what I'm gonna do now um, you can see I replaced this we're we don't know what kind of door to put in yet 
for now, since I can't get to the back right there, I got to move those chests. We're going to put an access way up in here. We're going to use standard ladders and watch this. Um, well, that's not fast. Is there some? Supposedly, cork adds the cork mod adds a another a fast travel up ladders, but that is not what I just saw. Okay, so we're knocking that one out, and then what we're gonna do is come out with a slab there. Okay, and then back here we've got um, a little bit extra alabaster right there, and do that as well and right there um, and then over on this side essentially um, yeah yeah this one's it's kind of hard to to figure out here I do have the glass what we can start doing is putting in the glass oh I see I see I see I see that's going to be kind of different there. Oh, and you know what else I did? I forgot to pull this wood structure in right here. And that gives us a little bit extra, um, a little bit extra wall space to, to work with. And we come around like so with the stained glass. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to finish filling in the stained glass. You see that pig going around there like that? Tons of tick lag. Don't know what it is. Anyway, let me finish the stained glass. I'll bring you back and show you what we've got. All right, so we've got the glass in. Okay, so you can kind of see that there. Next up, we've got to do this balcony that's off to the side. Let's see if we can get that on camera. It's a little bit... Odd. Yeah, I knocked out that pillar. That's the one that needed to be gone. Oh, and over here, this should all be spruce wood. That's what I was missing. And are we going to have enough? We're not going to have quite enough, but we've got a couple more. Yeah, we got it. We got enough. There we go. Good, 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 good. All right. And then over here, come off the back with some slabs like so and oh i hate it when it does that um supposedly it's like a one pixel section there on the bottom that if you hit it will do that fun fun thing which is not so fun actually um not a fan not a fan and then over here coming with alabaster once again and we'll have a column like so. Yep. And then we'll come across the top with a little roof action on the lower lower slab like this. And there we go. Okay, so we've got a little bit of a balcony. We're just going to close this off right like that and put a torch down probably should knock out this tree I'll take care of that off camera but at least get it away from the house so this is the rough outline of the house and now what we need to do is move all of this stuff around and then we'll get the floor in so let me move let me uh, let me get situated here and we'll make this thing a little bit a little bit less clunky down here all right Back in a bit. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I think it's time to bring you back in for a little bit more progress. And what I've done is I've moved all of those items out of the way. And that means we can fill in our wall right here and then put our ladder on the back like it should be. And there we go. So the bed is going to be up here. We're probably going to have most of our crafting and stuff, at least for the short term on that level and we'll have cooking down here but for now we've got to do a little bit of flooring and I went over to the community building got myself some I doubled up the iron I threw in some more 
iron ore as well just to keep it going but uh, what we can do now hopefully this works like it has in the past okay and let's see what kind of marble we should do I'm thinking yeah big tile we'll try that and see if we need to add any more and then over here just fill in like that I'm standing above that hole well no no I can I can tear that out and that and you and you and you okay so what we're gonna do is start our our pavers like that and we'll grab the big tile marble like that I think that should be good yep 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 and we will have to do the marble again uh, where did that go a few more I don't know how many we can always return it to its original state as well so oh Captain Q has joined let's let's say hi there we go and go with the basalt paver and there and maybe right here what do we do I don't I'm not really sure so does the wall continue down and maybe we do like that like that or or how's that go we definitely need a, a light source down there but hmm I don't know you let me know um, one thing's for sure we can't have dirt right there so let's continue the spruce wood do we have any more no no more in our inventory we'll do that and then we'll put those ladders back maybe go down here like so okay and maybe we can dig that out and I know you're not supposed to dig down but you do what you gotta do all right so let me dig dig all of that out oh 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 problem we might end up with with the darkness we definitely don't want to mess with darkness right now and these are the last two pieces of clay that I've got. Um, yeah, so I guess I just have to figure figure this out here. Ooh, and I I feel comfortable using the shovel. Awesome. So that means we've got a new modifier in here. Yeah, four modifiers now. Way to go! It's a stone shovel. Hmm, not very exciting, but it'll it'll do. And then down here, let's put a torch on the floor, and then we'll put... No, 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 no. That's the downside of having the offhand do the torches. And I think we should be able to put a birch door. Yes, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. We, Yes, there is a birch door on... No, 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 not there. Okay. What I want is torch right there torch right there dig this out and we'll take this out as well to give us a little bit more room and then we can put more of that marble right like that okay well uh, let's take a look at our handiwork okay we'll step back here I don't like the birch door don't worry we'll we'll get a new one I don't know what we'll do though so if you have any suggestions about the door let me know and if I happen to record again before um, before I get your feedback I will not replace the door but there we go I think that's a, a much better spawn house and um, yeah it's a lot better than the mud hut and I certainly like it and I will put a link to actors tutorial in the description box below so feel free to go check that out and check out the rest of his tutorials he's got a lot of great building ideas but we're going to be starting our our modded adventure in here ooh, 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 ooh. problem no there we go awesome okay I think we're good and uh, yeah we got a much nicer place to sit and survey the area 
And we can certainly turn off that. Very nice. All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, a like is always appreciated. And if you haven't done so already, think about subscribing so that you are up to date with everything going on on the channel. But uh, that's going to be it for now. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.